guys! Welcome back to Lucy Savile's 31 Days of Horror, where we are again playing The Fall of Grant Manor. Uh, so, last time I played, this happened. I fucked up. Yeah. So, I'm not too happy with that ending, and I am going to play this game until I beat it, basically. Um, it's probably going to destroy my mind doing it, but yeah. Okay, so let's get straight into it. And if you want to read all this crap here, you can go and have a look at the previous video. Okay, so first we're going to go talk to mother. Let's see if that's what we had to do. Trail ends here. Okay, so there's nothing here. Let's go to room number two. Is, is it? Okay, that is creepy. It's a lot less scary second time around. Creepy, still, yes, but not quite as scary. Someone is watching me. Okay, instead of touching the teddy bear, I'm just going straight to read the book. Okay, maybe that doesn't work, so maybe I do have to touch the teddy bear. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay. okay, so now I can go and read the story. Yes. Okay, so I'll just re-save the game here. In file 2. It's not creepy at all. Okay, so I wonder what happens if I talk to see if I... Okay, no, I can't do anything with that spirit. Okay, so let's talk to the girl. Okay, so let's see what happens if I do the other op this first option. Do you really think? I don't know. Sometimes it feels like she's still here with here watching me. I miss my mother. You're right. I should go. Thank you, miss. I won't ever forget you. Oh. I can feel that she crosses over. Rest in peace, child. Okay, so let's go talk to the mother again. Do not be afraid any longer, child. Do you know who I am? You're that little girl's mother, aren't you? Correct. I'm also Lady Grant. What's left of her after my husband killed me? Lord Grant murdered you. My husband thought me unfit to be his wife anymore after I gained too many years of age. He felt it hurt his image. What a dick! What the fuck? So he killed you? Not immediately. He started by simply ignoring me. Eventually he kept me locked inside the manor so no one would see me. It was like this for years. Lord Grant grew more and more mad with every passing day till I was in the garden, weeping in front of my child's tomb. My husband hated Margaret. He thought she lacked potential, that she would never meet his high expecta expectations. That's why I'm sure he... I was weeping when all of a sudden I felt a sharp pain behind my head. 
who hit me with this shovel. That's my last memory before waking up like this here in my bed. I'm, I'm sorry. I've roamed these grounds since, vowing to ensure the suffering of Lord Grant for what he has done to us. When he finally died, victim of his own judgments, I thought my pain would be over. But unfortunately, my husband's evil would but outlast his flesh. In his afterlife, he has claimed the lives of many and experimented with unholy rites. The pregnant woman. Indeed. She is one of many, I am afraid. I could not let it happen. I would stayed to try and protect those who, that would come here to, and to protect my Margaret. But he is much too strong for me. I'm afraid all I could do is stand idle and watch, hoping to at least help my child find peace. You, however, have proven yourself capable of making things right. I watched you as you read Margaret our favourite story. Thank you for that. I am forever grateful. You're welcome. Now that Margaret has passed, why have you not followed her? I have one last task. To give you this a key to our basement. It's where you find my husband. I was unable to vanquish him. Perhaps you will have better success. Good luck, peace bringer. You have received a key. She has passed. Looks like she also left a note on the floor. Look to my grave if you want to defeat the demon. Okay, that means I have to go outside to the graves? Are you fucking serious? Fucking saving this again. I'll go over that first while. Well, this grave is much deeper than it should be. I can't see the bottom, but it looks like there's a rope going down. Okay, I don't know what to do. Um, shit. Um, go down the rope. Fuck it, I've saved. I should be alright. Ouch. down there. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Okay, cool. At least I can get back down. Okay. At least I've saved. That that's the thing. Looks like there's a cave entrance so I can get into this grave wall. Creepy. Yeah, you're telling me. These children. Poor unfortunate child. Poor unfortunate son. <laughs> Sorry, that's automatically where my mind went. I don't like this. 
Uh, just give us a moment. Okay. Sorry about that. Let's continue. Unlock the gate with the key. Use that as a bridge. Who dares disturb me? Okay, whatever. Shut up. You're a prick. Use wood. You're a prick and you're gonna get what's coming to you. Another weak mortal, no doubt. From the system. I know who you are and what you've done. You've come here to worship and serve me. No, I've come here to stop you. Stop me. You clearly do not know what I'm doing. Uh, don't like that. Ha! No longer feel them. What have I done? Ha! They've left the realm. No longer yours to torture. Prick! How dare you meddle with my family? They were mine. You shall suffer for this. My family, then I will I'll have yours. Hmm. I wonder if I should try banishing him again. It has no effect. Ha! What? This is impossible. Holy symbol grows brightly. Hello, husband. Oh, she's pretty! You... You must stop this, my love. The suffering has gone on long enough. Be quiet. <laughs> You're a prick. You cannot control me no longer. I've crossed over, and from here, I'm untouchable. Doesn't matter. You can't stop me. Stop this. It has no point. Margaret is here with the, me. You can join us, and we'll be happy again. Daddy! No. This world. It needs me. The world has long forgotten you, husband. What have you accomplished except for murder? You dwell in a basement, powerless. It is over. You're right. What have I done? Come, husband. We forgive you. Aww. Thank you, Helena. You have saved us all. May the light protect you always. Yes! After final incantations to protect the manor from rogue evil spirits that might have been summoned over the years, Helena left, feeling confident that the residents of the town would no longer suffer from the torments of evil at the haunted manor. The end. I won! <laughs> I won at a horror game! <laughs> oh! Oh! That I am so happy. I don't know if you can tell by the smile on my face right now, but I am so happy. I I don't need to play that again now because I did what I wanted to accomplish. I wanted to beat this game and not let my fear control me. And ah, I am happy now. Oh. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video and you and whatnot, remember to give it a like. And if you've got any suggestions on games that you want to see me play, leave a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe to see more videos that I post because yeah, I still can't believe I won that. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna end it here. Bye guys! <laughs>